Hello guys, in this video, I am going to be showing you how to change the admin password, uh, the admin password for the 40 switches. And for this, um, we will have to do it from, uh, from the CLI, um, because even though we have changed it before, but by default, uh, each 40 switch has an admin account with our password and to replace the admin passwords, uh, for all the switch, for all the, for all switch 40 switch, uh, units managed by a 40 gate, uh, we're going to have to run some CLI commands. So for this, what we're going to be doing, of course, CLI console, right? We are in the ISFW. That is great. So here we are going to go to, um, actually before, well, let's go ahead and go over here, um, config switch controller and then switch pro uh switch not switch group we want to go to switch profile and if we do show we can see over here that we have two of them so we have the default and we also have the switch profile so we have two different profiles so you need to know which profile or which switch uses what right i think they both are using the switch profile but if you want to take a look at that you can go to config uh, switch controller manage switch we want to edit uh, 17 first and if we do show you can see over here that is this one 17 is using the switch profile has the profile right now if we go next and if you want to edit the other one to take a look this one 68 and do a show this one it's using oh, it looks like this one is using the other profile I think it's using the default profile because this guy over here is using the set switch profile to switch profile but what we can do is we can just set it to this All right we can just copy it over here and we can just say set switch profile and we can just make it to be in the same one and it that is great so now let's go ahead and go into the config switch controller switch profile and here we want to edit the switch profile right if we do a show you can just we did the set login to disable um if we do a set login again um, and do a question mark you can see that this uh, what this does is that it just disabled the um, the zero console login basically but the way that we want to do our thing if you do uh, set login password override and if you do a question mark over here so override a manage 40 switch admin password so we want to enable this right because when it is disabled the admin um, administrator account password so it's going to use the manage for the switch admin administrator account password so we want to basically overwrite this and then we want to set the login password right and over here if we do a question mark it's just going to ask you what you want to set it up to and i'm saying oh so it is a minimum of eight characters there we go so now I'm setting this to admin one two three four five six. All right, let's go ahead and end it. How do we test this? Uh, there is one way to test this. Uh, there's multiple ways actually, but the easiest way is by if you do connect to CLI, and over here it's going to try to SSH to ten dot two fifty five dot one dot ten, and you just want to enter the password that you just configure. There we go. I'm in one, two, three, four, five, six, and we are now in this switch. All right, switch one works. Let's make sure that 68 or switch two also works. And again, it's just trying to SSH into this 40 switch. So let's go ahead and admin one, two, three, four, five, six. There we go. So we were able to actually. Login, so that is great. Um, that is working. Just show you how you can change the password for all of them. Um, one thing is that just uh, you can create a um, you can create 
a profile and then you know assign the password there and assign the profile to the switches or if they're all using the default profile you can just do it on the default profile and change the password there so yeah guys this is it for this video hopefully you guys enjoy this video like always every single video that i make is really good and i'll see you in the next one guys bye bye